welcome to Dice Quest. My name is Maddie, and I play Vendy Underboro. All right, you keep an eye out, and <laughs> after a while, you kind of get bored. Doesn't seem like much is happening other than local traffic, people walking down streets, carriages being pulled by horses. And you turn to look down the alleyway again, and it seems like the two people you had watched just a little while ago have gone. Rangrim, make a perception check with disadvantage, please. Oh, heck oh, yeah. Oh, to wake up and you're, God, I hurt <laughs> everywhere. It's called being <laughs> unconscious. There's my, there's my bag. What? What happened the dice right there? I, I only have 1d20, though. I need to roll two. Oh. I've always used Young one Uber. D20. I should really have two d20s out. I'm gonna be rolling a lot of disadvantage. Do you want a green d20 like those alien no. cheeks? For I have a red one. Oh. On a scale of one to ten, how hungover is he 20. going to be? It's not gonna be too bad. He's so disadvantage. Still fairly young. It's a perception check. Check that was a fourteen and that was a twelve. So twelve plus three is fifteen. Okay. What do I see? Do I see anything? Do am I anything? am I no wake up? You, you know are what? unconscious. He shit himself. Congratulations. <laughs> are you I really hope someone didn't steal my sword. So, what are you doing, Vanny? I'm assuming that since I got bored watching human traffic, I'm just picking my nose leaning against a wall. Okay. Great. Marilyn, where are you going? <laughs> That's my single action. I'm just... <laughs> I am going to look for... Like a potion shop somewhere where I can find a owl. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So you're really looking happen? for like a higher end potion Sweet. shop or ingredients shop? Yes. Make a perception check. Hold up. Where? Oh, I put it right there. I'm an idiot. Um, perception. Sixteen okay. with modifiers. Um, looking around, you don't see anything. But after you ask a few people, they point you out in the right direction. And you see a very nicely decorated potions shop. If I steal anything and I get caught, I'm going to blame it all on you. <laughs> I'm You're not, not even with no. me. Oh, I'm still sitting against a wall picking yep. my nose. You're by the tavern. Yes. Why didn't you have you to go with that? With I was the one you guys were on shin. opposite ends of the... Oh, yeah, the wall. <laughs> of the alleyway. <laughs> ah, I see. Um... Seems like there are some lights on. There seem to be one or two people inside, and a elven clerk or shopkeep, whichever you prefer. Okay, isn't a clerk more like market sort of stuff? I honestly don't no. know. I think a shopkeep no. more of like. I think clerk works in this situation. I can look it up later. I don't care enough right now. <laughs> At this moment, who cares? <laughs> right now, I don't care. Uh, <laughs> so, I'm just gonna since they're still open. I think I'm just gonna go okay. hide out. How sneaky just are you? Just hiding at out it? until because... they open. Oh, are they closed? No, until they close. I mean, sorry. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So, where are you kind of deciding to plant yourself? Uh, probably hiding in the shadows, like, across the street, maybe in an alley or something where I okay, won't be go noticed. ahead and make a stealth check for me. Please, for the love of God. <laughs> Don't fuck me. Uh, let me just... Oh, I've got a minus How the one. fuck? That makes it... Okay. Oh, How do you get a negative one? With an, a nine or an eight one in, in your score. Uh, you got a negative one, you have to get uh, a seven or a six. No. What? I'm confused. Because you nine. don't roll zeros. Nine is a... Minus one, but you yeah. roll... The lowest you can roll is a one. The one minus one is not negative one. N- what? what? If a nine is minus one... Yes. And you roll a nat one... You rolled a nat one. What are you talking about? I think we're talking they about negative. negative uh, they on. got a negative score, right? Like the no <laughs> negative modifier. Uh, oh, yeah. I was gonna say like, it's, like you can't get a below a one unless or a below a zero unless you have minus two. Never mind. We duff. We okay. Big so a drug moment. Did you say drug moment. Drug moment. Drug. I was like, 
what? <laughs> I'm like, you uh, don't do drugs. Uh, no, way too innocent for that. I am too innocent. In I'm the like, shadows. I'm like, I'm like a 16 year old who does his homework and has a good child. <laughs> <laughs> I <laughs> don't. <laughs> All right. You hide off in the shadows. You pick your nose. Yes. Oh, this how, is epic. How long would you guys like to stay up? Like, what do you mean? Like, I mean, I'm here until the awake. place closes. It's getting at least, late. So. You're getting tired. Oh, I thought you were talking about in real life. I was like, you want to end it now? I was like, we've only been recording for two hours. <laughs> <laughs> um, since I seem to have my task is no longer needed to steal tongues. I want to go look for some babies. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Don't steal a baby arm. I will steal your arm in real life. <laughs> just coming at me with a pencil. Ah! This is what I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. And Jack, very quite good sharpen these pencils. I did sharpen these, these pencils. These are very nicely sharpened. And I put you. pencil sharpeners out for you guys. He did. It was very nice. You're a good man. Look how prepared I am. He is so prepared. He really is the best There's DM. a lot of, like, microphone. I cannot. But, there is yeah. a lot of microphone. I'll take it's your word good. for it. But, I like the setup, actually. It's, I do, I do too. I like I this one more. So, just confirm, I don't Feel know if uh, Marilyn bought a room for him, right? No. You have no idea. Shit. Okay. Also... My sword might be gone. That would kind of suck. Can I go back to the tavern and ask where the very Your drunk sword's dwarf with you, is? With isn't it? I very big failed sword. a perception check. Because you said his sword was still on his back when I went. It was. And got but I failed him. a perception check. It's just a random perception check. Which is not good. Actually, mm. I don't know whether or not I failed a perception check. I don't know anything. It's possible. It is a possibility. I want. That I, I a perception really check. hope, even myself, that you rolled the perception check to not shit yourself. <laughs> That wouldn't be a perception check. That would be a constitution saving throw. That, that would be, be a constitution saving throw. That's hilarious. <laughs> Thank you for the clarification, Jack. Okay. Throw back Get to your stuff together. So in another campaign, uh, Jack's character saw a dragon, and earlier that day, Jack had been like oh my dealing God. with so a dragon and was super like worried about him. No, so literally we, we're we heard this, like roars, yeah. and I was like, if that's a dragon, I'm going to shit my pants. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it was a dragon. First thing I no. said, I looked at the DM, and I was like, Okay, I'm using my action to shit my pants. <laughs> and then I am using my movement to run. Yeah. The other direction or towards the dragon? Away from the dragon. Away from oh. the dragon. <laughs> Don't want to die. You got like a <laughs> pants full of dewy. We were like, like level ah! three. Like waddling towards it very quickly. <laughs> anyway. I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you, I think, baby. So what are you doing, Benny? Um, I'm going to go back to the tavern and ask the barkeep. Uh, what would you say her name was? I didn't. Oh, she never introduced herself to her? <laughs> to you? Or I guess not. Well, no, I never asked but her. she was a dwarf and she was cool. She was like, anyways, I want to go back cool. to the tavern and ask where my very large, mailed friend, drunk one, is. What? She just let me drag yes. that uh, man away. I just English. thought about that. <laughs> where did the half-elf drag the drunk dwarf away? Oh, upstairs. Second room on the left. Thank you. You're welcome. I'm gonna go that way. Okay. I understand the door is locked. The door is locked. The key is in the door. Is it? Did you just leave it in the door? I'm gonna yes. unlock it. Okay. That was a useless way to lock the door. <laughs> right. So kind of I'm gonna unlock it's it it's on the inside. inside. <laughs> oh, it's locked from the inside. Oh, it is. yeah. So the key's on the inside. Because I went out the window. You How would I have left it oh, on the... Oh, yeah. <laughs> I was going to say, like, if you straight up left the key on the outside, you might as well have not locked it. <laughs> the door is obviously locked. The door is locked. I'm going to go back downstairs. Kay. Is there a window to this room? Yes. I'm going to go outside. Climb the wall. Into the window. Okay. <laughs> Am I in the room? Just roll a I d20 for me. Just one. Just one. Don't fail me. It's an 18. Okay. Let me do this really quick just it, to see. My window was open. Okay. So you climb up, you look in, you do see an unconscious dwarf on the floor. So presumably you're in the right place. Great. I enter. Presumably. You enter. I You're in a room. Look. Congratulations. Around. Okay, what are you looking for? Anything. All of the things. Okay. There's a bed little wash basin there's like a little wardrobe is there a is there a <laughs> I mean 
He is wearing armor. Does he have a sword on him? No. Shit. Fuck you. <laughs> shit. You drunk little shit. <laughs> shit, I'm gonna have to go on a sword adventure. Sword adventure. Look what you did. Can I Dude, walk? I'm gonna have to, like, beg my god to be like, okay, can you tell me where this is, please? Is I just he want facing one upwards or downwards? Is he, like, nose to the floor or up he, towards the ceiling? His face, he's, like, face first, but, like, he's on the side of his I face. I wanna grab him by the hair and smack him really hard. Okay. Go ahead Winky and make winky. a performance check. Just to see how well this goes. Uh, is that a nine or a six? I have one Let's has a dot on it. Let's see performance on your slap, Fanny. I think it's a six. And then my performance is three. So six, seven, eight, nine, nine? Yes. Yes. I was going to say ten, but that's a number too high. That is. So I got nine. You slap him in the face. Yes. Your little halfling hand leaves a mark on his bearded face. (laughs) My tiny baby hand. (laughs) My tiny little Trump hand. Yes. (laughs) He does not seem to wake up. Damn it. Do it again. Do it again. (laughs) Okay. Go ahead and roll again. (laughs) Is that another six now? What? Is that another six? There's a dot. It's That's a six. A six. <laughs> the other one are oh, the nine. The other dice. That dice sucks. Okay. <laughs> it's too late. You're gonna slap me a third time now. Right, I'm gonna slap him again. Okay. Yes, please. For love God. You do think he's gonna be bruised on that left cheek now? <laughs> I got a three this time. Jesus. <laughs> Use this one. Him. Use that one for the fourth slap. Can I? Can I flip him over to the other side of the face? No, he's he's left to the sure. door. The next one goes on your ass. Okay, are you right or left hand dominant? I'm right hand dominant. Are you like bitch slapping him or are you using the left hand? I'm full on like the palm out hand. So left hand? Yes. Okay. Since that's your non-dominant hand, take a minus two modifier. Damn it! We need every advantage we can get. Can you just slap me with the back of your hand with your dominant hand? I got a nine. Good lord! Does, is he still wearing the full plate armor? Yes. Yeah. Is his ass covered by the armor? Yes. Can you just play the plate armor? Just to play the armor around. There's like shoulder like it's just clanking by my ears. I'll wake up. Just shake the shit out of me. Make your performance check with Please advantage stop. this time. <laughs> with, with advantage. With advantage. I'll keep saying advantage. it until okay. she hears it. With advantage. advantage. You have one you already advantage, rolled not once. all of the advantage, and you've already rolled once. I did? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, well, two of those sucked. So we'll you were supposed to roll two, not four. You should have just rolled a zero. Can, can, you might just... Okay. We One of them is a ten. So can it be that one, please? Sure. Thank God. Yes. <laughs> you managed to wake him up. Yay! Yes! After being you are not nice, feeling but, good like, return of the at king. all. <laughs> you're just like, you wake up, you're like, what the fuck? I'm like, I want to slap oh, him Jesus. one more time. Can I get like, him one more time? <laughs> Uh, right cheek or left? <laughs> what so happened what? last night? Okay. Don't slap you, my ass! I'm so no, no roll needed. <laughs> Hold on. You slap him in the face, yes. your cheek hurts. <laughs> You're just like, motherfucker, I'm awake! Jesus. God, my face hurts. What happened last night? You just got like ten tiny little slaps. Where's right my you? sword? It's up your ass! You lost it. Where is my sword? You lost it, I just got here. Shit. Uh, or I guess I'm a dwarf, so shite. Um. <laughs> nice save. Fuck, my mother's Good brave save. tit. Eh, fuck. That's Ugh, Australian. Okay. Um. A food did well, you fuck. When he's hungover, he just goes into accents. I will be right back. Um, Good luck. Well, uh, Jesus. Um. I like that you choose to leave, like, or, guess, while you two are having a conversation I guess, as well. I guess I worship Herodine. Oh, it's Herodine. My guy. We're gonna have to find that. Five more minutes. Switching over to Marilyn. Okay. Hi. <laughs> Probably for the best. <laughs> Captain's quarters to Marilyn. Marilyn, do you come in? Yeah. Ground control to Marilyn. All right. What? <laughs> I just thought it was funny. <laughs> so, um, you are up been a little while. Doesn't seem like the shop's slowing down at all. Lights are still on. 
few people have come and go. What are you going to do? How long have I been standing here? Give me a rough estimate. <laughs> Little under an hour. A guesstimate, if you will. Uh, yeah. <laughs> and you um... are starting to get tired. Like, if you stay up much longer, you're going to have level one exhaustion. Tired. Hi, Max. My dog oh, has decided to come down downstairs. He's hello, freshly hello. groomed. He looks very floofy. He's I adorable. love him. It's delightful. Max, come here. Please pet him for me. He's I coming. Him. Oh, Lord, he's coming. Oh, no. Shay, I'm going to have to send you a picture because he's freshly groomed and adorable. Please do. I love your dog. <laughs> Max. Back up. No, he wants to love you. <laughs> Alright, Max. Max. What's he doing? <laughs> there we go. That was a good picture. Oh, you were taking a picture. I love that. That one there? <laughs> Max, yes, he's, he's a very cute dog. Hangouts. Me. Shay. Set. <gasps> Bam! Oh God, your You're getting a dog. I know. What? <laughs> Okay. What we've been talking Please. about, the fluffy-ass dog, it's so, delightful. looks like a sheep. You've He's been cute. there for about an hour, getting kind of tired. What? <laughs> I miss him. Alright. Hi! Aww, he's so cute. <laughs> he's adorable. <Aww. laughs> I love him. <laughs> I'm sorry, I love dogs. <laughs> and now he wants to be my, he wants to be I my chair. I cats and oh. two dogs, I'm allowed to have a good time. Okay. He won't jump up. No. No. He's Aww. too old. Oh. Oh, they speak. Okay. Um, oh, sorry. I can't remember. I think I spoke different into sitting up. <laughs> baby. Anyway. He's a baby. What are you okay. going to do? <laughs> I guess I'm going to head back because I guess I can come back later. Okay. Heading to the tavern. Why? Because you lost Did your I master time thief? limit. What do you mean, time limit? On my quest? No. Your master thief. Okay. I got really stressed for a second. <laughs> A sneaky as a snake. So you're so headed back, back to the to where I left the dwarf. Okay. Do you climb in through the right. window? No, I'm gonna pound on the door. <laughs> okay. There's you two way. hear a pounding on the door. Oh god, I have to stand up. Or oh, hair dog, I have to stand up. Let, I have to stand up. What did you do? Let me in. You're like over hair dog, I lost my sword, and then he struck you with like thunderbolt. <laughs> You are definitely feeling it this morning. It feels different than you recall, but... What do you mean it feels different? Your drunkenness? Like, you... The connection to the sword? You're not quite sure. It just... Like, it doesn't feel like you're normal drunk. Oh. Jesus. Did I get drunk? Oh, oh, shit. Yeah, you got drugged. Someone drugged you. Oh. I got I was being drunk. way too nice to him at the bar. I've, I've had that kind of ale before, right? Yeah. Did it taste different? Did it feel weird after I drank it the last time I had it? No, not this way. Mm, shit. It'd be like, Vanny. Do either of you let Marilyn in? <laughs> oh, uh, I'm still gonna keep pounding at <laughs> the door until I'm I like, let you in. Give me a fucking minute. <laughs> Give me a second. <laughs> no. I'm gonna I open the door, door for this room and be I like, you, you get like, off your ass and let me in. a hair dine. Last night was weird. I will come unlock in. the door for Marilyn. <laughs> and then I'll close the door. I'll be like, Fanny. City dweller. Small one. <laughs> me. Small one. <laughs> uh, by the way, Kiss does me. anyone inform Rangrim that it is not last night? It was earlier this night? Yes. <laughs> earlier this it's night. It's fine. <laughs> not too long ago. You're... You woke me up that early? God. Yes. <laughs> you lost your, your sword. Swordless. What would you like us to I do? I feel weird hangover. Um, you don't feel hungover yet. It's not been long enough. You're still drunk. Oh, I feel but, like I feel like it's a weird, weird. I feel weird drunk. Weird mm -hmm. drunk. I uh, is it dizzy? Do you feel like you want to die? Do I feel dizzy and like I want to die? Is it? I rupees? wouldn't say dizzy, but you feel like you're disoriented. Not, yeah, disoriented is a good word. Is, for are you it. disoriented? Do, do people put strange things in the ale here? Do I know anything about drugs? And putting drugs in things. I hope I should. <laughs> Skooma. You're an urchin, right? Yeah. yeah. Go ahead and make a medicine check with advantage. 
cool. Roll twice, take the higher. Do you want assistance? I know we're supposed to ask before we get the okay, roll. Okay, I got a 16, and then where would I find a modifier for that? Medicine is wisdom. Uh, is medicine. So at 16, 17? 17. It doesn't sound like any drug you're aware of. Ah, I did not drug you. <laughs> I didn't drug you. I didn't drug you. I would have used something to wait, 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 you wait, forever. Drug? No, I just figured they put they made their ale strangely here in the cities. Could they have made their ale strangely in the city? I'm going to assume uh, no. Wait, wait. You could put things in people's drinks. Yeah. They're like oh, a yeah. little tiny pill. You put oh, it in hair women's dyed. drinks oh, and then no. they don't remember anything. Oh. Done. I'm a horrible person. Never do that. PSA, I'll kick your butt. Yeah, I feel like the, like metagaming, that is like a shitty thing to do. Do not ever do that. I'll kill you. That's awful. Um, but in game... In game? I no. think I got my shit stolen. I didn't roofie the fuck out of you. Um, yeah. The reason I know what that is is because of the hangover. <laughs> That's a this magical pretty good movie. This potion is called roofie. <laughs> also the IT crowd. That was a good one. I'm just waiting for you guys to decide what to do. Um... <laughs> Or continue this conversation. I'm loving it. You're like, hey, I yeah. love the role play. <laughs> I need to give me a role play all night. I'll need take to, it. I need to talk to the barkeep. I will go talk to the barkeep in your stead because I'm talking to the barkeep and I'm Can gonna try walk? and stand up. Would you like you some stand assistance? Up? He throws up. Am I okay? Does he throw up? No, you're not okay. You managed to stand. <laughs> you're he... leaning against a wall, but His you can stand. I'm gonna try and walk. Okay, slow going. But you're making it. I'm gonna grab like the door like handle the and be can like, I kick him? Oh, wait till you tomorrow. certainly can. No, no, hold make up. an attack roll. Guys, I was role playing. <laughs> <laughs> and you're playing Damn. with assholes, so <laughs> y'all are just like, sucks. this guy ain't moving wait, fast. Wait, what's an attack roll? Kick him into gear. D twenty and um, you're kicking, right? Don't hurt him too much. He, yeah. We have Add to use him later. Strength or dexterity. <laughs> and you do a backflip off of his ass. You're proficient <laughs> so in unarmed because strikes. Because we love you. Because everyone is. So add your proficiency as well. You're like, no, you don't. <laughs> no, I got a 20. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. I'm not going to hurt him. I'm just going to knock him over. <laughs> so. You just kick him out the door. <laughs> so you're not something. aiming to injure? Just kind of no. like sweep the leg? Oh. More like in the rib cage. Oh. You just kick him in the ribs. He has armor. He's fine. Okay. I want you to kick him like Marilyn sideways into the bed. Kicks you <laughs> in the side of the chest plate, <laughs> knocking you over. Do I really even feel it? I'm still kind of drunk. No, <laughs> you don't really feel it, but like your world has been turned upside down. And you fell over. You fall. You did not fly. <laughs> you fall. I fly. I no. fly. No, you don't you fly. Fall. You fall. <laughs> I'm gonna be like, you we bitch. can wait till tomorrow, and I'm just gonna kind of collapse against the wall. You're just gonna lay down. I'm it's, already laying down. It's good. I've already fallen. You roll over. You were just forced slightly. to lay down. No, like I don't even move. Like I just kind of collapse. For oh. Rangroom. We- beat the fuck out of him. Okay. <laughs> I beat the shit out of him, better. and then you kick him immediately after. <laughs> so, what are you guys gonna do? I'm gonna go down to the barkeep and ask some, uh, some questions. Okay. I'm gonna go with you, because okay. I'm not just gonna sit here and watch him drunkenly sleep. <laughs> and you're sleeping, I presume? Um, or? we should probably lock it's the door and shut the window. It's less of a sleep and more of a unconscious kind of thing. He already okay. lost his sword. What else does it's he like, have to it's lose? Like, you know like when you're like super tired after a super long day and you lay down and you're just like gone? It's like that. Okay. It's like a really deep sleep. Um, I don't know. Like all of the money he doesn't have. The rest of his armor. Do you still have that hammer on you? I have like eight copper. If the they, only if thing they stole stolen my money, was the sword. That was it? Yep. If they... S- Shit! It's the cultists. I got roofied by some cultists. <laughs> wow. You are and they stole my sword. I'll, I'll Shit. lock him in the room so he's not a this danger so to bad. anyone else. This is okay. literally the worst. I'm about to kick the shit out of this I, I love watching the puzzle pieces come together. It's so much fun. This is so bad. Okay. <laughs> this is why Rangram's I love DMing. Rangram's back up, and he's just about to kick the shit out of this barkeep. Like, I'm gonna, like, kick the door open. I don't know how much force I'm using. You're still drunk as fuck. I know. I don't even know how much force I'm using. I'm just, like, pushing things open. I okay. want to see him, like, running at the door to bounce off him. I'm gonna, like, grab my hammer and just put it in my back. Just in case. Okay. 
So you go ahead and go to kick the door, make an attack roll with disadvantage for me. Uh, do you want to just, like, roll percentile and see how much force I actually use? No, no. Okay. So, because you're trying to <laughs> kick the door out, right? Just, like... Kick the door open, yeah? Like, I'll, like, unlock it and then just, like, throw it open, basically. I mean, it's not locked. Yes, it is. We I'm, locked it. Oh, okay. I'm just gonna. Okay. I locked it on my open. way out. Like, I'm not trying to break the door. I'm just trying to like throw it open. I, okay. I'm trying to get it. it open as quickly as possible. Drunk Grug might not know. Okay, then right. go ahead and roll a D100 for me. Okay. Because like when you said kick down the door, I was gonna be like roll an attack so, like, with disadvantage because like, 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 interior like, doors open. I'm just like I'm gonna be like kind of drunk. Door closed. Door needs not be closed. Door, door open. No longer door, 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 might, open. door might get away. Door open. <laughs> Hold on. Kay. Door might be gone. Door might be gone. You might just... 82. 82. All right. You fling open the door. You make your way down the stairs. And as this is happening, what are you two doing? Uh, well, we obviously hear the door get Not kicked. yet. This hasn't happened yet. Oh, um, am I the, down the stairs of the barkeep yet? Yeah, you guys are both there. Hey, you. So we're what asking the... questions, probably? Yeah. Yeah, what are you asking? Um, hey. Our friend was down here, he had a sword, now he doesn't have it. Did you see anything? <laughs> Any sword thieves? Any sword thieves? Yes. No. Big, play me sword. Mo- most of my patrons have swords. It's on fire! It was possessed by a god, we pulled out of a lake! What do you think Don't that looks like? You so just revealed so much shit. Shut oh my up. god! <laughs> Can I just cover your charisma? Her mouth? Just like just your charisma sure. does not make up for the fact that you're kind of fucking us over. <laughs> I already told you guys not to let me speak for important things. <laughs> I'm gonna try and cover her mouth. Okay, <laughs> you managed up. to cover her mouth, and this I'm just holding a finger like this. Bar- barkeep does give you guys a strange look, kind of one eyebrow raised. What are you guys going to say? I don't get to say shit. <laughs> you don't get to say covered. shit. <laughs> I'm just screaming. Like, <laughs> <Okay. laughs> Alright, Kenny. <laughs> I can't so you didn't see anything? I mean, I, what don't, did he drink? I don't see why many people would have a reason to steal a sword. Most of them have one. What did he drink? Uh, she points at the two casks on the bar next to her. That? Can I smell it? Sure. I was just gonna do that, yeah. I hope everyone is enjoying episode 18 of Dice Quest. This campaign is going really well, and everyone on this end is enjoying it. I popped in the middle of the episode to let everyone know that I will be naming random NPCs after those who mention us on Instagram or Twitter. I will also be naming people who submit to our subreddit. I'll be doing this until the end of 2019, so everyone who mentions us before December 31st will be getting an NPC named after them. If you want to support us on Patreon, you will be getting the same privilege as well as some other perks, like getting each episode on Monday instead of Wednesday, an in-episode thank you, and access to a behind-the-scenes podcast where I work on the campaign, but try to keep it spoiler-free. If you do want to support us on Patreon, the money you donate will go towards better equipment, our recording suite, podcast hosting fees, additional music, artwork, and a lot of fun stuff. If you would like to support us but can't donate any money, no worries. We don't want anyone to have to worry about money because of us. Instead, you can just share us on social media and tell your friends who might be interested in D&D about us. That would mean the world. If you have any questions or just want to talk D&D, you can join our Discord, which can be found on our Patreon page at patreon.com slash DiceQuest. You can also send us an email at DiceQuestPod at gmail.com, or send us a message on Reddit, Instagram, or Twitter. Okay, that's everything I have for you. I will let you get back to listening to your podcast, and enjoy as they start to piece things together. So, you have a sniff of this cask. This one seems to be about quarter full now. Does it smell... So, I'm assuming I do drink, obviously. I'm assuming I've drank drank this. Drunk. Drunk this before. (laughs) Does it smell any different? You 
give a whiff of this ale. Go ahead and make a perception check first. 20. 20? Nat or? Nat. Okay. So you don't need to add modifiers to Nats. So, they should smell strong. Like, stronger than a lot of liquors, but it's clearly an ale. Which is interesting. Okay. But, um, let's see. Nothing really smells weird about it. I mean, other than given its potency, no. And you, you grew up in more of a human city, right? This does not look or smell familiar to you at all. She said there was two there, right? There are two casks. One is empty. Can I smell the empty one? Sure. Hello, Larry. Okay, I got 14, and then my... Wait, I'm doing perception, right? Drink, yes. Smelling. Perception is your senses. I got a 16 plus modifier. Okay. Is the 16 total? Mm-hmm. Okay. Smells the same? The same? Okay. Like, clearly empty and wooden, but... Right, but it has, like, the same smell yeah. of it. Okay. The same overall smell. Did I smell anything, Jack? <laughs> Do you want to smell? I did. So I don't think I'm... Go ahead and make perception checks for which barrel are you doing. Um, the one that still has stuff in it. Okay. All right, yeah, go while ahead she's rolling, perception. I'm going to give my hypothesis. I don't think you were drugged. I think that they... 19. Pon- they mix the alcohol potency with something higher to make sure you got drugged. Well, so this ale is meant to be super high. Oh, I'll tell you when I get down there, actually, because I'm a dwarf. So, I know 19, you said, Marilyn? Mm-hmm. Okay. Again, smells oddly strong for an ale. Doesn't smell familiar at all, but... I mean, you don't really pick up anything too interesting. Um, you did roll a nat 20 on the... Okay. It smelled oddly of fish. Ew. But they both did. Like the wood or the alcohol? Yeah, ew. The alcohol. <laughs> hmm. It might have been, like, slight poison. Because some fish are poisonous. Some fish could knock you out, too. <laughs> At this point... <laughs> You hear a door upstairs slam, and steel boots hitting against wood steps, and then at the end, kind of like a steel crumple, and you see, like, Rangrim, like, barely holding himself up against the two sides of the walls (laughs) next to him. He's green, he looks like he's gonna throw up, and he's just like, where is it? Does not look healthy. I'm gonna, like, (laughs) lean against one wall and point at the barkeep and be like, we gotta talk real quick. Okay, about what? I had a sword. Okay. You saw the sword. I did see the sword. It was on your back. I've been hung over a lot before. Yes. Doesn't I, feel like this. I can't imagine, so you... Who prepared you, my drink? I mean, prepared it. Me and my two boys. About, let's see, looks at the barrels about two years ago. Uh, and, I'm like, Vanny, 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 Vanny. But... I, I don't think you're hungover quite yet. I mean, you probably started drinking about three hours ago, maybe. Like you're still drunk as shit. And Did you check the ale for the, 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 the drug thing? Yeah. It didn't smell oh, like it. The barrel does smell y- like fish. Yeah, there are no... Of course it smells like fish. My, my fish. I mean, you, you, grew, you said you grew up in Whitewater, right? I mean, did you know the barkeep down there? Well. Did I? I don't know, did you? Yeah. It's up to you. Yes. And (laughs) did he ever tell you the recipe for this ale? Did he? I don't know. You tell me. Keep in mind... He gave the vague details. Then you'd have a good idea that you live next to a pretty big lake. And there's a certain type of fish in that lake. And I think you can fill in the rest. That fish has toxins in it. Oh, but it's part of the ale. And we're like, oh, of course. This is a dwarven ale. It's strong. It's supposed to be strong. I'm going to be like... It's the strongest ale I've ever had in this tavern. And you drink an entire barrel full of it? You fuck. No, him and about half the pub. Ew. Listen. Drank a cask and looks in. I'm I'm going to look at her. three quarters. Yeah. I'm just going to say in whatever tone comes out... 
Drunkenly mostly, but carry on. <laughs> You're just swearing. <laughs> well, like, it's either between, yeah, yeah. like, this and, like, <laughs> this is, um, Okay. <laughs> so between, like, like angry and apath- apathetic? Yes. <laughs> sure. Okay. <laughs> Whatever you feel like comes out. Just, just tell me <laughs> I'm what you say. Like, Have you met with any... Who are we up against? I forgot. Or cultists. Cultists. Uh, Have you met with any cultists? Uh, warlocks. Cultists. Anything. Warlocks. Warlock cultists. No. Insight check? Can uh, I do one? Sure. Go okay. ahead. With disadvantage. You're very drunk right now. Before you roll, would anyone else like to roll this insight check? Yes. Shay? I'm good. Okay. 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 Why did you roll two, um, Vanny? Because. God. Just roll one. I'm going to roll the one that I got a higher one. <laughs> no. <laughs> Pick them both up and roll one of them. What? Roll one of them. It's 12. 12? Is that total? Uh, for insight? Insight. Wisdom. Uh, Damn, I one. have good insight. 13. 13? Nice. Rangram? Uh, 16. 16. What was your total again, sorry? Uh, 13. 13. I had to think about 16, it. she's definitely hiding something. You're not entirely sure what. Wait, hi, bitch. <laughs> I'm drunk. Am 13. I about to just pull a, I want names on this lady? <laughs> you certainly can. 13 seems like she's leaving something out, but you're not confident in that thought. Vanny's never confident in anything. What are you not telling me? I'm just gonna, like, look her down and be like, something's missing. Who did you meet with? Who did I meet with? I meet with a lot of people. It's kind the of world, a... The did you meet? Have you met with any shady characters from any sort of cult? Any sort of cult? Let's see. Do we count the so-called gods in this cult? Oh, shit. Um, <laughs> the Divine Watch isn't part of the cult. The Divine Watch not part of the cult, then... No. Wasn't if we're not watch. counting the gods as hey, wait a second. being members of, like cult Part of things. Part of the divine watch, one of them wasn't there when we were checking it out. Yeah, the halfling took Are off. The divine watch working with it. No, there's no way. Why would the hell would they have us hunted down then? Yeah. I think they took the sword because it's like, oh man, this is a holy artifact. Pete. <laughs> they know it's not their art. They would have left it. They wouldn't Maybe. have taken it from a traveler from a different guild. I'm I mean, like my understanding, which might have been wrong, is like the guilds are not always friendly with each other. It's one guild, but it's kind of separate sects. Yeah, like and each sect they're, isn't. They're not necessarily friendly, but they kind of respect each other's places right. in the world. So, like, they wouldn't have they wouldn't have just like taken it and given it to Herodine, but they respect that it's not theirs, and they don't really have anything to deal with it. So unless there's something going on with those Divine Watch members, which there kind of is, not gonna lie, like they're green, <coughs> they're green, they're green. Man, Turn into Shrek. Wait, do you know that though? <laughs> uh, no. I actually don't know that. So I actually don't know anything about the Divine Watch, and I also trust them because I'm a very oh, pious shit. paladin. I'm gonna be like, is it worth cooking? What did the Divine Watch ask for? Why were they here? Why were they here? Uh, they told me because they wanted to talk to you. They said you had some information for them. Yeah, they didn't really stick Can around. Can I do an either. insight check? Yes, you may. Yeah. Do I still have disadvantage? Yes. Would hot. anyone else like to roll? Yes. What are we Wait. rolling for? Insight to see I'm if sorry. she's lying. Wow, I got a crystal five wow. on that one. Jesus Christ. Um, I actually didn't do great. I got like an 11. Do not fear. <laughs> I actually got a 19. Right. Yay! You too. Seems like she's telling the truth. Marilyn, her pants are on fire. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. You're just like, bitch, you lying. Are you going to announce that? Please announce yeah. that. So what are, what are you going to say? Are you going to tell us the truth? What do you mean by tell you guys the truth? Your ass is on fire. Because I know you just lied. Lied about what? Your bomb walk? Ah. <laughs> the divine watch. Like, being pretty vague here. But I'm more I'm more like, so you say I lied. Hold on, real yes. quick. She like, is she like a buff dwarf woman? 
She doesn't seem small. Am I stronger than this woman? Probably. I'm just gonna like grab her by the shirt. I, I like at this point I am past my limit and I'm drunk as hell. I'm just gonna yes. like grab her by the shirt, slam her down, and be like, "What did they want?" And I'm gonna roll intimidation. Okay, with disadvantage. Can I roll? I feel like drunk Don't big throw dwarves with hammers are pretty intimidating. <laughs> Oh, well, shit, I got your so, image of your tattoo. That's cool as fuck. I'll say, I'll, um, I'll roll it with this. Here, oh, here, thank you. Here's my thing with intimidation, though. I think it's dumb that it's under just charisma. You can mm. use strength as well. Would I have disadvantage with strength, Still too? with disadvantage, okay. though. Because you're also... drunk and kind of bumbling around. Can I look menacingly? <laughs> They're the same either way. You but... can help him if you'd like. Okay. Now, are you going to help him? Yes. Okay. Straight roll, then. Just one die. I know. Okay. Fuck. You don't roll, Maddie. Fuck. If you're helping him, he just rolls with advantage, but he had disadvantage, so. 1d20. What'd you get? He got a good old two. two. He threw up on it. <laughs> <laughs> so I kind of just like, and don't do it, I guess. You got halfway through it, got really nauseous, and then put her back down. Let me just open Can up I, like, my binder really try quick. Try again. <laughs> just like, give it another go. Can I do it instead of him? <laughs> Damn, that would have been so cool. I was just gonna just ask like a Maddie was dwarf, just like bam, what did they ask? And then mm-hmm. nope, halfway you got through, you're like really not just like Ugh. you like lunged forward and ran into the bar. <laughs> just like fell over. You hit your knee on the one of the bar stools. You're like, ow, mommy. Hey JJ, you should hand me that right. uh, water. Um, mm-hmm. what's your yeah, give me that armor water. class, Rangram? <gasps> oh shit. <laughs> Uh, don't spill on my mics, please. I'm gonna spill it it's on cool, the mic. crisp. Sixteen, because I don't have a shield. Uh, okay, that I closed my binder when I should have not closed my binder. That is attack. a sixteen to hit, even. Is she attacking me? Yes. Well, yeah, you tried to grab her and what throw her over the She's like, about to get the hammer. <laughs> no, actually, she's not. I'm gonna follow my oath even when I'm. But she is about to get intimidated. Can I stab her? No. All right, so you kind of lift her up by the shirt, yell something kind of incoherently, and this bluish energy comes from her hands as she casts Eldritch Blast on you. Rangram, go ahead and take nine force damage. Okay. Well, and she's a I would warlock. Also, like to bye point bye. out <laughs> that. All three of you have level one exhaustion. You've been up for a while. You've been passed out, but have not been resting. I've You've just I've kind of been, been like unconscious. Two. So I have, like, double disadvantage on everything? No, just normal disadvantage. Okay. I'll be kind. Is the exhaustion basically, basically like, because of my drunkenness? Yeah. And then it's just, like, because they're tired? Yeah, you're tired, you're drunk. on the other side of the bar where we are, or is she on the back? Of the bar? She's behind the bar, currently. <laughs> Can I lunge over the bar and pin her to the ground? Before you do that, everyone go ahead and roll initiative for me. Oh, shit. Nice. Hey, that's like a 19. I can try again pretty soon. <laughs> uh, I got a 10. And then what was I rolling for initiative? D20 plus your um, initiative modifier. Rangram, what'd you get? Uh, 19. 19. Marilyn? I what got a nice 17. 17. Where's initiative located? JJ, can you point to initiative? Um. It's uh, right by your speed. Uh, speed, initiative, plus 4, oh. so 10, 11, 12, 13. 14. It's 14, duh. I big dump. <laughs> grunt, grunt, not back. Oh, wait, you add initiative? Yes. 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 Oh, so. It's right next to your 19. speed. Hey, we're your... both going on 19. Wait, Stuff. 19? Is, what's, Plus two. What's your dex modifier? Minus one. So you should have a minus one <gasps> initiative. Ow! Fuck me. Okay. I broke it and I bleed. I bleed. You need, like, <laughs> tissues? I need a hug. And I need a new nail artist, damn it! I can't All of your no nails are breaking, yeah. Uh, and they haven't even lasted a week. I paid a hundred bucks for these. Almost. <sighs> That's a lie. I pay like eight bucks. <sighs> oh, God. Where Ew, is it? I- Blood. Uh, oh. Does it like rip off your actual nail? Yes. Mm. Rangram, you're pissed first. as hell. It broke it. Ew. Are we in combat now? You are officially in combat. Hey. I don't, I don't know if I want to just smite this. 
But you know definitely don't, don't, want don't lie. You want to smite this kid. I don't know. She's a warlock, me. but I want answers. That's why you pin her to the ground and be like, give me answers and not fail this time. So I'm thinking that like what I'm going to do is I'm just going to like heave her up and just like slam her on the bar. I should have taken Tavern Brawler. Why didn't I take Tavern Brawler? That would have been cool. Be like smiting people with a bar stool. Like that would have been kick ass, but I didn't. So, so what do you want to do? Cry. Do you want a tissue? Yeah. Uh, okay. Is she still get, like, like is she still like in my or arm, top? or did yeah. I drop her? You dropped no. her. You probably dropped her in the shock. All right. Yeah, I'm just gonna like reach across and basically just like try and grapple her to the table and make it so she can't do anything, and then just be like real intimidating. Okay, go ahead and roll another intimidation check with disadvantage for me. Okay. Where's my other one? Are you? Oh, yeah. People can't help me unless they use their action now. Yep. Ow. All right, let's hope for the best. Oh. Fuck. Okay, I'm gonna stop intimidating and just start smiting because that was a. Can I try to intimidate? That was a six. From myself. You can help, can't you? Yeah. But if she wants to use her action. Yeah. So if you don't want to do that and you want to just get, like, stab him. Uh, I thought you wanted answers and not stabbies. You don't know that. Alright. But the thing is, the thing is, <laughs> metagaming just like a touch. The other one's a five. <laughs> so, so, like, if you don't help, it doesn't really change. Do you have anything for your bonus action, Rangram? Because intimidating was your action. Is my, like, hand on her? Can I just, like, smite her through my hand? Like you're holding her currently. Can I just like is that smite a bonus her action? Uh, yeah. It says you charge up your weapon. Can I just do that like through my hand and just like boom? What a mm, gut punch her? I think that's more for like proper weapons. Okay, that's fair. Anything else then? Mm, let me take a quick gander. Uh, while he's gandering, I'd like to uh, pull out a knife and. Wave it in her direction very menacingly. What's your yeah, passive perception? Uh, my what? Passive perception. Uh, it's on the top of your character sheet. Initiative, AC. It's like above your um, stats. Oh, passive perception is 13. 13? Okay. Uh, Marilyn, what's your passive perception? I'm looking. Okay. And Rangrim, what's yours? Uh Oh, it's... um. And because you have... so 12. Oh, I just 12, realized we're fighting 13. in a bar Wait. with probably other people yeah, in the bar one. that want to probably... Where is it? Um, on yours, it's near the bottom below your stats. <laughs> on your character sheet. Okay. So, all of you, because you have disadvantage, are sub-10. Disadvantage oh. is minus 5 oh. for passive checks. Um, 13? Who said 13? Me. Okay. 13 would get you an 8, so I feel like an 8 would be enough to notice about. 10 people stand up, draw swords in this tavern. 8. We've picked the wrong fight in the wrong area. I'm gonna be like, she's a warlock! You didn't notice this. Oh shit. Like, the 8 was generous. She's a warlock! We're going to... Um, I didn't do anything. Yeah, I haven't done anything yet. <laughs> it's his fault! Marilyn, what would you like to do? <laughs> Just kidding. I promise I to stand up for you. Can I try I and calm everybody drunk. down? You don't know. You don't notice this. Hey, you big well, dumb. I mean, I was planning on trying to get between Rangrim and the lady anyway. So you can try to calm them down? Sure. Yeah, just like, okay. let's not do anything stupid, please. <laughs> What are you going to do, Rangram? Go and be like... A lot of people. I'm not going to say that. I'm just going to be like... Not right now. And I'm just going to like... Should you... Dip. I'm going to okay. say, like, leave the bar. You're leaving the tavern? Yeah. Okay. I'll come back in the morning. Marilyn? I would not anything else it. you're going to no, do? No, like, not, like... Well, yeah, we'll have to find I'm something gonna out. I'm going to head out as well. Okay. Vanny? I'm gonna wave and be like, sorry for all the inconveniences. <laughs> Bye. And this barkeep kind of tells everyone to sit back down. And you guys leave. Great. 
Can I go back down the same alley that I saw them going down? Sure. Who are you? Oh, were there two people? So two people with the two divine people. Walk. Those were the two boys. No. No. That was the divine watch. That was the divine watch we were following. Earlier. Yeah. We can't tell the divine watch that we lost the sword. Like they will not help us. You actually should tell oh, the divine. Oh, I should watch. probably tell them what I saw. I feel like they're not going to help us, and I don't want to lose standing in my place in the divine watch. Sure. Right? Do you want to tell them what you saw, Mar- Marilyn? But we should tell them that she's a warlock. Guys, <laughs> what? So when I left Rangrim in the room, I went out. Sorry. No, you're fine. I, I just, went out the window. JJ was just a little far from the mic. So I left it open, and when we left, two of the Divine Watch were standing below your window. What? Mm, mm. Yeah. Mm, I did say mm, one of the halflings mm. did. JJ's eating cookie. I have a idea, but I'm eating cookie. I'm telling you that one of them was gone, <laughs> and you were like, no, I trust them. What a horrible idea. What if? They had green spots. Does that mean anything? They're what if possessed. the people below the window were the brothers? And they stole clothes from the Divine Watch. But I saw them. Oh, were they like the people? They, they were familiar? I finger gunned them. <laughs> Marilyn, you did literally talk to the dragonborn woman. Mm, yeah, okay. So. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, uh, no, it was not them. Unless they know how to, like, try to modify themselves and make themselves look really different. Polymorph! <laughs> yes. Or right. disguise self, that would work. Or suddenly switch <laughs> gender. Maybe they were going under an operation. I need those. <laughs> we just never know. So it is possible that you were not talking to the real Divine Watch. Hey, that would explain the green hmm. shit. There were three Divine Watch inside the tavern, too. And two there were, outside. There, there were, were three inside. Two outside. Two that. Two outside the window, and the halfling took off. Hmm. You both did see the divine. Well, you didn't see the divine watch leave, but it wouldn't have been hard for them to leave, without you guys noticing, as you kind of were talking by the chimney. Um. Hmm. I don't know. What do we want to do? I mean, we know where they are. I'm out of the tavern now, right? You I are. have to find a way to talk to that lady. Without getting your ass kicked by everyone We know the where bar. she but lives. It's, it's wrong for me to sneak in. I don't know. Is it wrong for me to sneak? Wrong, <laughs> yes. Do you care about that is the real question. <laughs> no. I, yeah, yeah that, I, I, would, I was going to be like... <laughs> it's morally it's, wrong... Some of you don't care it's that it's morally, morally wrong. I don't agree. The majority but don't care. <laughs> if you were to do that, I Wait, might whose turn house a blind into? eye. Am I sneaking into the Warlock, barkeep? Warlock barkeep. Wait, she, she knows live something in about the tavern? sword. Her bedroom isn't where everyone else is. Do we know where this woman lives? Are you suggesting we sneak into her bedroom and I'm not her? suggesting <laughs> anything. <laughs> He's I uphold the law and the goodness <laughs> in the world. He's pointing towards the bar <laughs> and then staff motioning. Were you to find some things out from this woman? This is the drunk side of the lawful paladin coming out. Lawful good <laughs> paladin you coming out. To find out where the funky fresh fuck my sword went. <laughs> <laughs> that is a good hold up. Hold up. I would where are my nuts? <laughs> Funky fresh fuck. That's that's right. going in there. I'm gonna per- turn on. my sneak like, my sneak up shit. to a hundred. I will turn a blind eye, and maybe I'll be very happy. That might be the drunk talking, but don't listen to me when I'm not drunk. Funky ah. fresh. <laughs> Funky fresh fuck. I love we, that. We got we got the name of the episode right there. Nice. <laughs> that was beautiful, okay. JJ. Thank you. <laughs> Good shit. True poetry. I'm gonna turn my sneak up to a hundred and okay. uh, sneak into the room. Whoa, 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 whoa! You're not, yet, you're, not, yet. You're not turning things. your sneak up to eleven. Yeah. Spinal no. tap style. I have an idea. <laughs> Thank you, chef. No sneak. Wait. Wait until <laughs> she's not expecting. Aww, but I, I so think we're just she, gonna wait around if you wait until, until she's not expecting, she goes to bed. More spooked. I don't care about the spook. God, I hope her I did. I care about stealing shit. 
it'll be easier to steal shit so when she's expecting it. So we gotta find her window. I think probably, I've never right? stolen anything before. The only thing I've ever done <laughs> I... against the law was worship in secret. But you're not you're not supposed to know that. <laughs> wow. I I need to stop talking. He big fuck. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now that I'm thinking about Big Fuck, have any of you seen the meme so far of That Fucks? Huh? No. That what? meme is going around my office right now, so <laughs> it's in the good thing, like, instead of like, man, that's cool, it's just, man, that fucks. It's going around <laughs> my office right now, so you'll be like, wow, we got lunch today? That fucks. And it's awesome. That's so delightful. then all of our older coworkers who are like, parents are they're, they're like that fucks and we're like that fucks and they're like i don't get it <laughs> it's the best <laughs> and then they try and say it but they say it wrong what do they say that bucks no no, no <laughs> that <they're>, buckets <laughs> that buckets <laughs> but no though they're like man that fucks and we're like no, no 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 like if it's good that fucks and they're like what why they're like you would only say fuck if something bad is happening you're like if i no Fuck describes every emotion in the right. human language. It just describes strong emotion. I'm like, if you every emotion. Got it. Like anytime you, any you want to emphasize, family, right. no, anytime you want to emphasize no, no, no. like a no, no, strong no. emotion. Have you seen the, the family? No. Watch it. <laughs> does does that movie like that movie fucks every emotion? That oh, movie okay. fucks conveys. <laughs> but it's, I try to explain it this way: of when you get free lunch and the company pays for it, that fucks, and they're like, oh. Then they're gonna be like, "Man, my dog died this weekend." I'm like, "That does not fuck." And like, that sucks. <laughs> yeah, that yeah. sucks. That does not fuck. But now that's going around the office, you just get to hear people on the other side of the office go, "That fucks," <laughs> and you're like, "Yes." <laughs> oh yeah, it's all coming together. <laughs> Full circle. Yes. All right. <laughs> so what y'all doing? Um, I was gonna sneak into this place, but I'm being told no. Let's just no. go do it. We'll go find a I'm window and we'll wait until she's asleep. I think that'll be easier. I'm I'm a paladin. I like to hit things. I need to nap. Let's go. Know. Actually, now that we're all exhausted, let's go find a really comfy alley. I have like five dollars. Dude, you have a room. I have if no you didn't money. break the fucking door, um, and if you didn't like. Literally, physically assault the barkeep. We that physically owns the place. assaulted the barkeep. I don't think we can go back there. I'm gonna climb through the window. <laughs> I guess it's locked from the inside. I. I mean, it's not locked anymore. Mm-hmm. Door's wide open. Out the yeah, you kind of busted the door. I'm not going back in there. We'll figure something out. <sighs> you just gonna sleep in the alley and get your shit stolen? And mug? No. You gonna get your butthole reshaped? How much? How much? How much? <laughs> How much silver do you guys have? Um, let's find out. I already paid for one of your rooms. I have... I had dropped it. No, 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 no. I wasn't saying that, like, but, like, if you guys got a room, I could... I, uh, oh, I have eight pieces roof. of silver. I have, like, no money. I, I'm I'm probably gonna be <laughs> sleeping in the alley and losing my shit. Um, <laughs> oh, Jesus dying. Christ. You can't die while we're on the campaign. Then we gotta find a I'm new so room. I'm so sorry. Um, I'll be like, you know what, you guys don't have to pay for me. I, um, I'll figure something. You know what? Let's go. I'll pay for whatever room he has, and then you can sleep on the floor. We're gonna go find a different tavern. Okay. Not hard to find. A large <laughs> city, many a tavern. Pick one that looks the almost least expensive. Not seedy, but not expensive. So like Motel Six. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Only a couple of cockroaches, not all of them. Okay. You find Fantasy Motel 6. Ah, man. <laughs> is it like Thanks. It's called... Is it like Tavern 6? No. Tavern six. It's called the Drunken Dragon Tavern. Uh. It's not great, but... I mean, it'll, it'll do the for job. <laughs> great. A I like that name a lot. Two beds. Possibly three. I, you, don't, you, know you don't Let's do two beds. Me. He can sleep on the floor. Thank you for listening to Dice Quest. I'm JJ and I play Rangrim. You can find us on Twitter at Quest Dice.